everyone and welcome to Frumel's mini crash course on influencer marketing and personalization. My name is Amelia and I am a business development manager with Frumel, focusing specifically on the world of e-commerce and everything that comes with it. In this series, we'll give a high level overview of influencer marketing and what it, that means and consists of, typical user behavior of the audiences that are most targeted by influencers and influencer marketing, and how personalization can bring your influencer marketing to the next level. Let's get started. If you are a marketeer working in e-commerce or with social media, then you've probably heard of influencers and subsequently influencer marketing. With 49% of buyers relying on influencers to help make buying decisions, it's no wonder that this is quickly becoming a key part to many digital strategies. In this section, we will give a high-level overview of the different types of influencers and content they create, different aspects to consider when choosing an influencer, and key KPIs and measurement tactics for your campaigns. As the name suggests, influencer marketing is a type of social media marketing that involves an influencer endorsing or promoting a product to their audience who follow them for a certain level of knowledge or social power. This can be done in two ways. Organic, meaning the influencer promotes a product they love without any kind of endorsement, or paid. The brand will work with the influencer to establish specific kinds of content that will be produced and provide some form of payment. Another key component to consider in this kind of marketing is distinguishing the difference between influencer marketing and user-generated content. User-generated content involves brands reusing organic content posted by a customer on their personal social media channels. For example, imagine you post a photo wearing your favorite shoes with a caption promoting how much you love them and then tagging or hashtagging the brand. By showing your interest in getting the brand's attention, they may then reuse your organic promotion on their own social media channels and also websites. User-generated content is a great way for brands to get a ton of content from different sources and customers, all of which are actively promoting your brand in an authentic and spontaneous way. The consumer is quickly becoming the next ambassador for brands, and in months and years to come, the line between influencer and user-generated content will continue to blur. 